Hello people and welcome to another Skate 3 tutorial and today this will be a quick tutorial on how to do custom doors and windows so um, most of these like won't require the merge glitch um, nor will they require DLC but some of them will so um, so but anyway here's uh, four in which I've made or well, five actually so and basically here's the most like standard window you can create basically you use the what's it called skylight I think it's called so you go to world terrain and it's near like around here it is there skylight wedge and you flip it like that and then lock into place just showing so like that and then what I've done is is that to make a nicer finish just simply get a pad and put it like like that so and that's all sort of make it look a bit more better so anyway that doesn't really look that great so you can't really add that much to it I suppose you could add a rail around the side and the top so then it makes it look like it has an outline to it but there's not much you can really do with that so and the next window so is this one is the bus shelter window so I find these quite hard to make so you just go to downtown bus shelter and what you want to do is is you want to get the angle right so and then you just get like one like that so and then you flip it upside down like that so then place it on top so basically you have two bus shelters so as you can see they stick out so and basically that add, acts as a sort of basic window so it's a bit more of a realistic size so I prefer using them when I can but I normally find them quite hard to use as I said right so the first door in which I've created is quite a simple one what you need to do is is you need the short rails or any rail you want short rails I find the best so then you want to go to plaza terrain then water pad so and then um, for the top piece this is a half width pad which obviously is a DLC part but you basically just place the rails on the edge of the water pads and I have three water pads merged into each other and that sort of creates a glass effect so it is obviously moving but it's the closest thing we have to glass in Skate 3 so the different variation of that is to use the catwalk supports and you want to use them in a 3 by 2 fashion so or whatever amount you want and then you instead of having it straight like that you turn the half width pad you can use an ordinary pad for this as well and then just place it like that and then um, as you can see you can kind of walk around like that so and then the final one which is a really simple one and um, it will require the merge glitch though if you're going to merge it into a wall which I suppose you would with a door so you want to go to the normal size pad go and then you want to go to style factory it has to be the style factory so it looks best and then you place one like that so and then the other one like that and then you just use a rail as the door handle so as you can see it was really simple to make your own like doors and windows so yeah that's basically the end of the tutorial so um, one quick note as well I just want to say thank you for the amount of subscribers in which I have I now currently have 238 as of making this video so I'm 12 away currently from um, getting my 250 goal so once I um, get to the 250 goal well I'll obviously make a subscriber special and you can actually watch my other video to decide um, like which one you want me to do or comment any ideas you have so um, but anyway thanks for watching hope you have a good rest of your day and see you all later